Hello guys, Golden Soldier here, and this is my first video on this channel. Uh, I uploaded the thing saying about my new channel, and it seriously got my got two subs in like two minutes. So no joke. And I don't know what we're at now. I'm looking quick. I believe we're still at two. Yeah, two. But that's crazy. I think whoever it was that came and subbed me that fast. You are amazing. Thank you very much. So I'm using the MSM MSBS here in this gameplay with a muzzle break, and I believe I'm using. Oh uh, yeah, I believe I'm using muzzle break and then foregrip or not foregrip. Pugh, red dot. Sorry. Maybe I'm using. F f yeah, it looks like I'm using foregrip. So yeah, I think I'm using foregrip and red dot on that maybe i uh, know it's got looks like muzzle break uh, <laughs> whatever i stopped it at the beginning of the video so you could see and held it long enough so basically what this new channel is going to be all about it's going to be about uh just having fun and doing what i'm doing and getting some good gameplays for you guys i'm going to go ahead and let you know i am a huge cod fan you know cod is my thing but Tomorrow, I'm planning on up... Well, not tomorrow. Well, whenever you see this tomorrow, probably. I'm planning on uploading a Titanfall gameplay. But, out of that whole stuff... One thing I want to talk about here is the new Call of Duty. Uh, I don't know how many of you guys are following this stuff. But I am extremely, extremely, extremely excited about this. Just because of the new call, the new company, the whole thing is the new. Uh, is called. It's it's all about the new, the new era. Is what they're saying. That's what it's all about. And I'm pretty excited about it. It's called Advanced Warfare. If you guys didn't know that, I'm just a kind of almost assuming you guys know this. If you're that big into COD, uh, I don't know why you wouldn't know it, but. It looks sick. I'm I am I've never been so excited for a Call of Duty. That's all I can say. I don't know. There's just something about it. But uh the one thing that is really they've been focusing on is the uh uh, private military groups they've really been focusing on those in this and then a lot of how it's a lot of money. They've just been kind of like that's what they focus on. They talk about it like every video. I don't know if I'll link the trailer, the teaser trailer, not the teaser trailer, the full trailer down in the description. And I don't know what you guys think about it, but if you guys go watch the trailer, there's like this wall that they put up. It's he like he get, pulls out a wall, and obviously it's in single player. But I don't know how they're gonna. It almost looks like a riot shield. If you guys go watch the video, you should know what I'm talking about. But there's some th it like if they add that in multiplayer i can see that being like a very very op thing and i guess uh, i have a lot of faith in sledgehammer but i just really hope they don't put so many op things because that's going to make people just hate the game even more and even more uh hate the game in general and because people are already n just not wanting to even give it a chance because i like ghost personally but a lot of people didn't you know it's not been one of their let's just say it's been one of their less popular call of duties in my opinion, it was still pretty decent Call of Duty. Probably the worst one I've played, but it's not, like, terrible. Like, I still like it. It's, like, if you guys know what I mean, it's like, I like it, but I like the other ones better. So, that's just my opinion. I'm sure you guys all have a very strong opinion on that. So, uh, so basically, I'm going to flash another picture here of some still images of the trailer, because I don't want to get, I don't want to get copyrighted. Obviously, I'm gonna be good. I'm, I'm, bleh, it's kind of, uh, first off, or this is really random. I'm throwing this in here. Screw YouTube for making it so hard to change to a channel name instead of your full name. It's so hard. I'm not even kidding. Took me forever, even though I've done it before. I couldn't remember. But I'm pretty excited on the new channel. But off that, I told you guys I'd be making this COD video. So I'm sorry this is gonna be going up on a on saturday i said it would be going up sunday i'm sorry uh just didn't work out that way um just i it was gonna be so late and now when i get this up and i had couldn't figure out my youtube stuff i just rented titanfall so you guys are gonna get to see a little bit of that so don't expect it to be like a regular thing because i don't even own it and i don't even know if i want to pay that much for it right now but i don't know if you guys heard i'm pretty excited if you guys didn't know i play on the 360 and they're coming out with it on the 360. And this is, I'm bringing up another controversial topic here. 
I don't think the Xbox One is worth it right now. Kind of like the 360 when it first came out. It was kind of crappy at first. You know, they had a lot of updating that needed to be done that they hadn't done. And it kind of made it a sucky console at first. And then they had to update and update and update. And then it got to where it should be. So, I'm not going to pay full price for a console that's not even done. I, it just doesn't seem right to me. It doesn't seem like it's worth it or anything. So I'm going to wait till it goes. I was either going to wait till the new Call of Duty came out if I couldn't get it on the 360. Or if, um, how was I going to say? Sorry. Or until the price drops. And I think I'm going to wait till the price drops now. So when the price does drop, I will probably get an Xbox One. It's just so much money. And I don't know if you guys know, I'm taking driver's ed right now. Tomorrow I have to go to a nine-hour session. Nine hours in the classroom, <laughs> sitting there and having lots of fun. Always great fun. I'm taking it out of town. At least I've got some good friends in it, which is always a little bit more helpful. And so I'm going to be getting a car soon, pretty much, is what I'm trying to tell you guys. And I can't... I can't really pay, shell out 500 bucks for an Xbox One when I'm trying to buy a car, if you guys know what I mean. It'd just be pretty hard, and I don't, I don't think it's worth it at the moment, so I don't think I should. But if you guys will notice, I'm going to flash another thing up here. It says this was captured on the Xbox One. The following, the following was captured on the Xbox One, which shows you that Xbox is still kind of partnered with Activision, and they've been kind of working together on this, which is always good for us Xbox fans. For you PS4 fans, I'm sure that sort of sucks. But I'm pretty sure we're going to get, like, like if you guys pre-order it, you get a camo, kind of like they did with Ghost last year. I think it's going to be available on Ghost and Black Ops 2, if I am not mistaken. And I'm not exactly sure, but... Uh, I'm going to try to find a picture of the camels right now, and if I find one, I'll put one up. But I'm not sure if it's going to be on both. But it's going to be pretty cool, so if you pre-order it, you get the free camel with it, which is always awesome. I don't know about you, but I like making my gun look nice and nice and good. And, yeah, there was some... Oh, I don't... Tell me in the comments what you guys think about the new how they're going to do the rotation you know with it'll be uh, sledgehammer games this year next year it'll probably be trey heart trey heart trey arc and then next year it'll be the next year after that'll be uh act or <laughs> infinity ward again and tell me what you guys think about that i think that sounds good so then they won't just rush to get out their call of duty because they need to I think they'll be able to take more time on it. Three years, I I'm, don't know anything about game developing, but I think three years should be good enough time to make a pretty decent game. I'm hoping they don't screw up all the next Call of Duties, because that would absolutely suck. And I was reading some of the comments on the video, the trailer, and obviously it has a ton of dislikes already. 16,000, and you'd expect that. 79,000 likes, though. Yeah, let's try to get that on my video, the like part. But, yeah, no, I'm just kidding. You guys, but, uh... So, I, I, I've been reading some of the comments, and what people are saying is they want to see, well, one guy, not people, one, one guy said he's always like, oh, he was upset, obviously this is a single player, which I don't think this kid was the brightest kid, but he said something about wanting to see, like, uh, heavy artillery, like tanks, helicopters, that kind of stuff, like battlefield stuff, and he wants to see that in Call of Duty multiplayer, and I, I just don't think that that's what Call of Duty's for. Call of Duty's for close, fast-paced action, you know? I think Battlefield, Battlefield's obviously fun. I'll have to play some on this channel. But I don't think Call, Call of Duty, if they do that, they'll be too much like Battlefield, and they'll just be trying to, like, I, I don't know what you, Tell me what you guys think about that in the comments. If they should put an artillery, we obviously don't know if they will or not. But I don't, I personally don't think they will, and I don't think they should. That's my opinion. Don't, don't quote me on that and say that's what's going to happen, because that's what I'm hoping happens, that they don't. But there's no telling what could happen. They possibly could, they possibly won't, you know. You just never know, and sort of sucks. And I'm, I'm, this is going to be a fun time. Make sure you guys do subscribe, so you can keep seeing, um, so you can see what comment or comment. I'm going to try to keep you guys updated on the Call of Duty stuff 
on all this new stuff we're gonna get beginning i think this was pretty much the big information i'll link the actual trailer down in the description i'll show a few screenshots unseen when i screen when i said i would and yeah so i think i'm really excited for this call of duty so basically final thing of the video tell me what you guys if you guys are excited or not put that in the comments and i'll gladly reply so thank you guys for what no i'm not saying that anymore i don't even know what i'm gonna say so thank you guys for watching See you guys later. Bye.